and welcome to another custom figure review. Today we're going to be looking at this, um, I don't know, would you call it a Series 9, unused Series 9? Um, basically this was a prop from that has been repainted, I think, from the, the Cushing movies, and it was seen uh, on the set of The Magician's Apprentice slash The Witch's Familiar, but was never seen on screen probably because it wasn't actually filmed, but um, there was probably a chance that they were going to use it. So I thought, let's make a custom on it, because it's, it's a nice design. Um, but yeah, I will probably have put a picture of the, uh, of, of the actual one uh, sitting on the set somewhere. Um, thank you to whoever took that picture. Sorry, I don't know who it is at the moment. <laughs> uh, anyway. Let's review it, shall we? Um, this is, like Dalek's, very simple custom. It started out as one of these. Um, I have a lot of, basically the chase set was reduced, so I bought two extra sets, and so now I have endless amounts of these Daleks. So I thought, let's customize one of them. Here's the other one. Um, yeah, so I've got a few of them now to customise, so if anyone has any suggestions put them in the comments and I will do that. Um, but for now let's have a look at this one. So yeah, it started out as that one and all I've done is, there we go, as you can see that's the original silver inside. Um, I took it off its original base and I had a spare um, one of these bases from the saucer pilot, I think, from the collector set too, because a few last year they were going really, really cheap as well, so I bought two of them. So I had a spare base, and I thought, let's put this together. So I took this, and it's been painted um, in a lovely red and silver all around, include all, including the bulbs have also been painted silver. Um, yeah, I really like the, the red with the silver. It sort of reminded me of the Dalek Alpha. Um, from the Eighth Doctor thing, um, but yeah, all I did was paint it, paint it up, and then place it on this base. If it will go on, there we go. Yeah, and it looks really nice. Um, just painted the base in the same colour that I did for uh, the um, for the rest of the body. The paint is actually left over from building the attic, which will be in another figure review. But it's not a figure, it's a set, so you'll see it then. But I bought loads of paints for it, and one of them was this red. So I thought I'll use it. I'm a bit annoyed that I didn't get a gloss, um, because it looks a bit odd not having a, a glossy dome. But I quite like it, like this. It looks really nice. It's a simple custom just a bit of painting and it worked out really well actually I'm really happy with it Ta -da -da. Um, yeah so yeah another series 9 slash classic Dalek to put onto my list of things that I have customed um, if you have as I, just, as, as I said earlier as I said earlier if you have any suggestions for the other classic cheese Daleks um, then let me know and I will probably get on to making some of them so yeah this is a short review because it's a Dalek but that's pretty much it I hope you enjoyed looking at my red Dalek um, and I will see you in the next one